Hello drone community, this is Alan at UAV Coach and Drone Pilot Ground School and welcome to this week's edition of our Drone Weekly News Roundup. It's a big week in drone land. First, DJI has recently launched two new products and has another one coming on November 5th. Also, the first human lung delivered by a drone for a transplant. And finally, we're gonna talk about a 21-year-old CEO that just raised $25 million for his US drone company. You ready? Let's jump in. A couple weeks back, DJI teased on social media three product dates with the tagline, good things come in threes. Well, two of those three products have launched. First up, the DJI Ronin 4D, an all-in-one cinematography solution. This beast of a camera uh, is developed for professional filmmakers. It's listed for $7,199. This is a bold product for DJI. They're not just a drone company. I'll be curious to see how this system is received in the cinematography industry and what products we're gonna continue to see from DJI in this category in the future. The second product to launch was the DJI Action 2 camera. This is comparable to GoPro's small action cameras. Uh, portable, wearable, waterproof, uh, and it's listed on the DJI website for $399. And sure, these two cameras are exciting, but I know why you're really here, which you've all been really waiting for, rumors about the Mavic 3. Yes, yes, I think we're gonna see an announcement about this on November 5th, so stay tuned. Next up, the drone industry has seen a lot of firsts over the last few years, but this one definitely caught our attention. Last month, the world's first human lung was successfully delivered by drone. The delivery took about six minutes and was made in downtown Toronto. The drone traveled just under a mile and flew from Western Hospital to Toronto General Hospital. The drone used in the delivery was custom built for the job in a partnership between Unithur Bioelectronique, a Quebec-based biotech aviation company, and University Health Network, the company that owned both of those hospitals. The recipient of the lung was a 63-year-old man from Ottawa named Alain Hodak, who said he was proud to be a guinea pig for this new transplant delivery method. This is an excellent example of drones for good, and we look forward to seeing more transplant deliveries via drone in the near future. Okay, lastly, drone company Brink recently announced that it has raised $25 million in its first round of fundraising. Leading the efforts was Blake Resnick, the 21-year-old founder and CEO of the company. Brink is known for its Lemur drone, which was created specifically for public safety applications. Resnick founded Brink after the mass shooting at the Mandalay Bay Resort in Las Vegas back in 2017 so that law enforcement could have tools to help them protect lives during active shooter scenarios and in other scenarios they face in their work. To create the Lemur, Resnick spent the last three years going on calls with the Las Vegas Metro Police Department SWAT. Brink has seen a fast climb since its launch in Drone Analysts 2021 Drone Market Sector Report. Brink was listed among the top 10 commercial drone companies in the U.S. Super cool to see this company raise this money uh, to continue to grow, to accelerate the efforts. All right, folks, that's all we have for this week. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on the latest drone news. Remember to check out the links below to read more about any of these stories. Thank you for watching, and to all of you drone pilots out there, blue skies and safe flying.